actual, this is actual, this is a new category. This is not small town news, and this is not view mail. Actual stupid job laws. That's the name of this category. <laughs> or rules, excuse me. Rules. First one I want to go over was uh, the robbery procedures and policies. Do you, you know a lot uh, about robbery? Robbery. You know about robbery procedures, Paul? No, kind of, kind of like a, kind of like a hold up kind of thing. Sir, this guy looks a little drowsy to me. What are you doing, Paul? Bad weekend, Paul? Or how was your, how was your weekend, Paul? Got a little sun out today. Oh yeah, got some sun. <laughs> hey. A little, a little drowsy from the flight over. Yeah. You learn any new stuff on that? Robbery Sorry. procedures and policies. <clears throat> Number nine. Oh, well, I'm going to do that if a robbery occurs. Number 11. Keep your hands in sight at all times. I think that's one of your wrestling maneuvers, too. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of our rules, but, you know, yeah. I never Keep abide by it. Do not talk to Robler, Robler. Do not talk to Robler. Is that another wrestling movie, right? That is, though, that's a wrestler. I know him. He the was, Robler? He used to be my tag team partner, but, you know, the I Robler? think I broke his neck. I'm not sure. <laughs> I think you broke your tongue, too, didn't you? Yeah, I got, I got this mouth. Yeah. Do not talk unless the robber asks you a question. See, you wouldn't want to butt into his conversation. Yeah, yeah. Do whatever the robber tells you. Freeze! Do not move unless instructed to do so! That's number one. I thought that was kind of neat. Yeah, yeah. So that's. I burned again. Are those coming back, Paul? Are those? Are those? In, what? By the way, what do you think of my haircut? What do you think of my? That's. I have kind of like the Bermuda Triangle right here. Uh, stuff goes in, but it don't come back out. <laughs> kind of like the people. See, Paul, like the Bermuda. Oh, uh, Dave. Dave. Yeah. Yes, Hal. Hal. Uh, get along with the show, please. Oh, excuse me. That's uh, Hal Gertner, our our uh, stage. Excuse me, Dave. Uh, yeah, yeah, how? Uh, would you please get the guests out, please, and uh, stop talking to Paul, please? Uh, is there something else? Is there something else, Hal? Oh, yeah, your uh, chai's not straight. Uh, besides that, is there something else? Get your ass going. <laughs> That's, that was Hal Gert Gertner, our stage manager. Uh, uh, excuse me, Dave. Yeah, yes, yes, Hal. That's Hal Gurney. Oh, Gurney. Hal Gurney. Right. Okay, here's our next guest. Is not only one of the few to be from Las Vegas, Nevada, but it's the only male that we know that uses hairspray. Will you please welcome Bob, Mr. Install, Megapora. Oh, how you doing, Bob? Hey, you have a seat. Wait, sir. So how, how's, how's things in Las Vegas? Good. All right, all right. And you had the distinction, as you are, already know, as the world's worst stereo installer. Bob. People think I am, but I don't think so. Now, I have a, uh, this is, uh, Jimmy, our stage, you know, you met Jimmy backstage, the nice electrician, uh, and he, yeah, he gave me a list here of things to test and see if you are the world's stereos, best stereo star. Okay. Uh, Excuse me, Dave, that, that's the worst stereo star, Dave. Uh, what, what did I say, Al? Best. Oh, I... I'm sorry, you are the first. Uh, thank you, Dave. Oh, uh, thank you. Uh, that's Hal Gertner, our stage manager. Uh, excuse me, Dave. That's, yeah. that's Hal Gurney. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Barbara, how is everything back there, Barbara? Hi! <laughs> <laughs> okay, problem number one. Mr. Bob, the world worst installer. How would you go about installing a punch 75 with the Concord 101 and a pair of tri-phase m and speakers? How would you set that up, sir? To test you on the world's worst <laughs> little problem with the camera. Uh, sir, can you answer the question? 